Hey guys, welcome to another one of our reviews. I'm the Worm, and this is the Proton. Uh, today we are doing another juice review that we did receive free of charge from jackbaby.com. Thank you very much, Andy. Uh, even though we did receive free of charge, this will not affect, affect, affect our review in any kind of way, shape, or form. It will be a true and honest review, as always. Uh, always. Today, we're doing today the we are doing blue tin. Blue tin. Uh, blue tin still. We're on number three, okay, which is uh, real vanilla. I. Uh, I'm so anticipating this, guys. I haven't actually touched this purely because um, I'm scared. Uh, I want it to be the vanilla I've been chasing since I started vaping. Vanilla was the first liquid I bought when I started vaping, and I so hope, judging by the record of these liquids, that this could be the one. Um, very quickly, guys, on these bottles, child safety, chip compliant, um, tactile labels on them. It does give you a use-by date, which is wicked. For, uh, May 2014 for these ones, um, but you, you don't you get that usually. Um, also, less than, no more than, sorry, 80% PG on these ones. No exact ratio. Gonna keep it company secret. Okay, guys, this tastes like real vanilla. It tastes like the actual um, the, the vanilla plant that you put in with cooking and you cook with the plant instead of the actual vanilla extract. It's, um, it's, it's very, I wouldn't say it's mild, but it's very smooth. But it's um, it's definitely vanilla tasting. It's just, um, well, um, not what I was expecting to be honest. It was I was expecting a little bit more vanilla punch, but it's more, it does taste more like when you're cooking with the actual vanilla plant. So for me, yeah, it's it's, it's actually quite nice. It's um it's definitely not the strongest of tastes, but it does taste like vanilla. You can obviously redrifting this. <laughs> Give this best chance. Um, but um, major price and stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah. This uh, the tin is obviously sixteen pounds. Fifteen ninety nine. Fifteen ninety nine. Sixteen. Six, fifteen ninety nine for the uh, tin. Five different flavors. You can also buy a fake mill for fifteen ninety nine as well. So uh, the, we, we didn't really check what flavor, uh, strengths they come in, but we're showing twelve, uh, eighteen, twenty four as standard. Um. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, He's waiting for me to start with these. Not saying I've, I've been chasing like the perfect vanilla for such a long time. Now it's like five months. Um, I've tried quite a few. This is the best one so far. Still not exactly what I want. It is the best one so far though. Um, it does taste like vanilla. It does taste like the, I want to say it's almost custardy. It's, it's, it's a creamy kind of taste for me anyway, but it's got, which is weird because it's got a bit more of a throat hit than the others have got. Yes. It's about a four on a throat hit, which um, for these is quite high. None of them have been that high. Um, 18 milligram chip, I'm going to have to point that out. So that will be playing a part because if you get this in a lower strength, then it's not going to be as high. The vanilla flavour, like I say, creamy sort of, very very mild custardness about it. I think that's just purely because that's what's fused to flavour custard. I don't think it actually tastes like custard. If that makes any sense whatsoever, if it doesn't, I apologise. Um, on one to ten, how strong the vanilla is? It's a six. It's not overly strong, um, nor is it weak. It is definitely vanilla. You can tell it's vanilla. It's, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Yeah, for me out of ten, I mean, does it taste like real vanilla? Yes, it really does. I, I've used the vanilla plant in cooking before. I know what it tastes like. It very much does taste like it. it's just um, it's just a little bit. You just could do with a little bit more punch to it, if I'm honest. So for what it's meant to taste like, it's like a 9.5. It is so close to being what it should be. It just needs a little bit more vanilla punch. For me personally, I'm not a lover of vanilla. I do use it in cooking and stuff, but I don't really vape it as much as Mr. Proton wants to. So for me, it's like it's sitting around like an eight because it is still quite nice. It's very smooth. It's it is almost that custody kind of. Feel to it. Creaminess. Mm. It's, it's very strange uh, to explain. Hard. It's not strange. It's very hard to explain. Um, for me, what is supposed to taste like? Does it taste like vanilla? Yes, it does taste like vanilla. Um, maybe my expectations for a vanilla liquid are probably far too high. To be honest with you, if I was going to tweak this, I'd like it a little bit more vanilla pod, a little less creamy, and a bit sweeter because vanilla is quite sweet. But I mean, we're I'm being picky. Uh, to be honest with you, this is by far and away the best vanilla I've tried. Usually, they tend to come across quite harsh. And you get a very mild vanilla at the back. This is not harsh uh, in the same way. A little bit more throw hit, but not harsh in the same way. It's definitely got that vanilla punch to it. I just I wish it was stronger. Um, for what it's meant to taste like, nine. Uh, me personally, since it's the best vanilla out that I've tried so far, it's a ten. Um, I was going to give it a seven, but I just can't. I can't give it a seven because it is the best vanilla I've tried. Um, and I don't know if you can get closer than this, which makes me sad. <laughs> <laughs> um, but it is a very nice e-liquid. It is very good. 
Uh, as always, from Jack Baker, to be honest with you. So it just seems to be the way they're going. It does seem to be a trend developing that they're the bollocks. <laughs> um, so sorry, well, Andy, if you wanted to put this on your site, I've just sorted it, but um, I can't help it. Well worth its money. Yeah, it's worth its money. I think there are nicer in this range, but it's definitely good vanilla. If you want vanilla, go for it. Definitely good. I think it worked well with some other. This and Black Crumble Squash. Yeah. Like Blackberry Crumble. Um, <laughs> 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 anyway, guys, um, thank you very much for watching. I hope you missed the proton. This has been the worm. See you, See you soon. Guys.